Next, notice that we've included a mirror on the table towards the front of the image. A mirror creates a reflection of an existing image, so you could say it creates a copy of whatever is looking at it. Therefore, the mirror should help you remember that HTLV has two distinct copies of RNA. We've also shown some icosahedral shaped containers that are full of water. This is where the water is stored as buckets of water are drawn out of the well. The shape of these unique containers should help you remember that HTLV has an icosahedral shaped capsid. Now you can see that we've added a rainbow to the background. Just like in our other images, the positive happy feeling of a rainbow should help you remember that HTLV is a positive sense virus. Now we've shown a ribbon on the handle of the knight's T-shaped flail. If you look closely, you can see that it's covered in blood. Recall that the Cancer Hope ribbon is used as a symbol for cancer. The blood on the ribbon should help you remember blood cancer. And the fact that the ribbon is on a T-shaped flail should help you remember T-cell leukemia lymphoma. So HTLV can cause adult T-cell leukemia lymphoma. Adult T-cell lymphoma is more prevalent in Japan, West Africa, and the Caribbean. So to help you remember this, we've shown a Japanese samurai guy, a West African guy, and a pirate from the Caribbean in the line waiting for water.